about how male attention is hyperinflated and women suffer, not suffer, women enjoy unlimited male attention. Mm -hmm. So how do you add value to something? Well, you make it, you make it scarce. Gold has value because it's hard to find. If gold was everywhere. It wouldn't have value. So I teach guys to put value on their attention. And that's what my course, a good hour of my course is about how you do that. And my very basic principle is the way I put value, the way you put value on something is to restrict it. So I restrict my attention. Absolutely. So if I'm talking to a girl and she says something semi sarcastic to me, or if she doesn't do what I want her to do, or she won't listen to me, I'll just stop replying. I won't insult her. I won't try and convince her. I'll just stop replying. Bang, just vanish. And you know what? Most of these hot girls, no one vanishes on these girls, bro. No one vanishes on these girls. <laughs> the only dude who's like, what? I gave him some sarcastic bullshit answer and he didn't text back. And before you know it, they're the one liking your Instagram picture. They're the one trying to get your attention again. And you know, you might still have to be the man and pop up again a month later or something, but they'll like your pictures. They'll watch your stories. All of a sudden they're like, this guy, because your attention is now valuable. You're the one dude who fucked with them. Every other guy is telling them they're beautiful. You're the one dude who's like, you know what? Your shit, bye. And it's all about frame. This goes back to the very basics of the game. Frame. You want to put value on your attention. I say this all the time with the biggest mistake people make in relationships is that, especially busy guys, you're busy, you're working, you're doing your, you're always busy all the time. And you, you text your girl in the morning, okay, I'm having a busy day at work, love you, talk to you later. Yep. And she doesn't hear from you all day. Well, she doesn't get any attention. Whereas if she starts an argument and pisses you off, You'll take time out of the day to text her and tell her what a dumb bitch she is. Well, now she's learning how I get his attention is through negative action. Right. You got to reverse that and talk to her all the time when she's being good. And when she starts to be a dickhead, ignore her. Yes, that is that is what's <laughs> called. And I'll, I'll, you know, it's, this is exactly what I'm talking about when I say that whenever I am like listening to pickup artist tactics, there is a behavioral psychology parallel to that. What you've just described is called operant conditioning. Okay. Yeah. What that means is, is you reward desired behavior and you punish, punish, or you, or you simply withhold reward from non-desired behavior. It doesn't matter. Even if you're arguing with a woman, even if you're calling her the worst names in the world, she's getting attention. I, I believe that one of the things in one of the, the, one of the segments of my course is that attention is the only weapon you have against women in the sexual battlefield. The reason it's all fucked up is because women are getting it. Here's how it should work. I'm a man, I give a girl my attention and she gives me sex. So I give my attention to get sex, she gives her sex to get attention. That's how it should work, that's the fair trade. But now you have girls who get all the attention without returning the sex part. And that's with friend zone bullshit, that's what friend zone is. She gets your attention, she doesn't give you the sex. Or Instagram followers, all that garbage. So the whole thing is skewed. So your attention is your weapon. And you have to use it very, very effectively. And if you use it effectively, you can get any girl interested in having your particular attention because you put a value on it. Most of the guys out here, the guys who buy my course, when they come back and reply to me, they say, I never realized how much attention I was just giving away. That's exactly. Mm -hmm. There's nothing that has a value if you just give it away. If you're following every chick, replying to every chick, going to see every chick every time she wants, and you're not progressing and getting anything in return, then who gives a shit about your attention? Mm -hmm. If I turn up on a date, the girl can just look through my Insta and see all the girls on there and the girls I'm following and the life I live. And she'll know that me even turning up is a deal. Mm -hmm. It's I too, if your, if your attention is too easily had, it becomes valueless to, Absolutely. to that.